Video is growing in importance to brand development in the outdoor industry. With me today is Tom Burgess, Director of Multimedia at Revenue River. He'll discuss with me today trends in video marketing that you can use in 2018 as you develop your plan. Two of the big predictions that stood out to me back in the beginning of 2017, uh, one being they're predicting that 74% of internet traffic, of all internet traffic, will be based off of video content. That's, that's a pretty astounding number. Uh, I think secondarily, you look at the stat of the top 5% of all videos retain 77% of their viewers until the last second of that video. So you're, you're talking about a, a big eight or a big gap in percentage that people can fill in to make sure that you're, you're capturing video content that's meaningful and lasting. Whether it's 30 seconds, two minutes, making sure that it counts is, is probably the most important. So I look back at those two stats as two big indicators that I was going for in 2017. There are a couple of data points that, that back up those predictions, and we'll start with the, the prediction of 74% of, of internet traffic will be eaten up by video. Um, you, you talk about the average consumer from 2016 to 2017 in terms of video consumption, which is rising 20%. So now you're looking at, at 2017, and you've got the average consumer will digest over 45 minutes of video content a day. That's astounding. And that, that feeds back into the internet traffic idea where you have video, you're gonna make it work. If it's taking up three, four, three quarters of the, the traffic on the internet, you're only gonna see that percentage, percentage rise. Um, the, the second stat that I actually really like, and this comes from more of a digital marketing agency background, when you talk about uh, viewerships, you have, you have this, this upper echelon of videos that eat up, or this, you have this upper echelon of videos that retain viewership of over three quarters of their audience all the way through the video. And when you look at this data point of, of digital marketing agencies are seeing 52%, a 52% increase in ROI from video content alone, that you talk about making the right content at the right time when it comes to video, especially in the outdoor industry, you're gonna start boosting your bottom line just from video alone. We've got a couple of key indicators about those predictions from data points that we've seen this year. And we'll start with that first prediction that 74% that of internet traffic will be taken up by video. Right now, as we're nearing the end of 2017, we've seen a 20% increase in average daily consumption of videos on the internet. Right now, people are spending over 45 minutes a day on average watching videos. That second prediction where we have this retention rate of, of a percentage of videos that, that keep viewers on the screen the entire video, this is actually a pretty interesting fact is that when you look at digital marketing agencies right now, at the end of 2017, 52% of agencies are saying that video is their top content piece of ROI. So this shift of, of consumption and viewership is now this actual stronghold to help drive business for your company. The icing on the cake for these predictions came from HubSpot and Real SEO. Uh, they stated that visitors are 88% more likely to stay on your site if there's video content. Now how that filters down even more is they're saying that you're 64% you're more likely to buy a product after watching a video in 2017. Video is a super critical element in any outdoor industry company's strategy moving forward for a few reasons. You talk about the, just the stats alone that we talked about before, but everyone is now digesting content on their mobile phone. Think about the industry that you're in when you have people outdoors, the, the only technology they have in their hands is their phone. And then you cake that into to four proven video types, whether it's product demos, explainer videos, testimonials. The outdoor industry has a specific product in mind. Any company has a specific product in mind. From a buyer's perspective, 
the idea of being able to watch videos that that are consumable and actually talk about your product from a standpoint of of understanding and, and, and knowing what that product, how that product works before you buy it, is a key piece moving forward when you talk about an outdoor company's strategy from a video perspective. As an outdoor company looking to expand past the, the standard text-based content into video, there's a couple of considerations. One, it's, it's keep it simple. Don't reinvent the wheel. What's worked in the past for your consumers will work for video. Just keep that same message throughout. Second is, is expand your knowledge on where your consumers are interacting. Is it on Facebook? For some companies, Facebook might be their key performance social media platform where you do get a lot of ROI. Some it may be Instagram. Some it may be neither. It may be on your website. So tailor your video content to your audience. And then just talking about those four proven video types you're you're an outdoor industry company you have a specific product show the consumer show your your potential customers what they want to see